Hey, I just saw what happened at Coney. What was that? Well, uh, remember my friend Harry? Yeah? That was him? How? Honestly, no idea. I think it's his treatment he's been... Oh, that's Harry. Gotta go. Hey, I cleared out the foundation. All right, I'll swing by. <laughs> swing by. Man, how many times have you said that in it literally? Prowler code says Uncle to stash here. My pleas for peace have been rejected by calls for violence. From, you know it, Spider-Man. An attack on what was once a destination for enjoyment now stands desecrated and defiled. Our cherished Coney Island was victim to a free-for-all brawl destroying iconic attractions and history itself. Some of my fondest memories were at Coney Island. My father used to buy me the nickel pop and hot dog combo, and I, like any self-respecting American, would overindulge. Now, it's all been taken from me. To make matters worse, Spider-Man seems to have brought a new friend along for his night on the town. Just what this city needs. Another vigilante to take the law into their own hands. One person wasn't enough for you to corrupt, Spider-Man. You need two acolytes to do your bidding? Add to the pile of unpleasantness the Hunters and reformed criminal Lonnie Lincoln, a.k.a. Tombstone, and you have a recipe for the ruination of any normal person just trying to have a night out. These Hunters are clearly after the Spider-Man and any of their accomplices. They're as much a blight on this city as the heroes protecting it. I'm sure old glory Mayor Grant loves what this does for tourism. Get in the hang of this thing. cleared out my stash at the old radio station. Was wondering where I was. That station was the hottest ticket in Brooklyn for up-and-coming hip-hop artists back in the day. You and Pops get any airtime? We got close, but they bumped us last minute for this next-level group out of Staten Island. I still got your beats if you want them. <laughs> NYC ain't ready for a prowler spotty mixtape. Take it easy, kid.
Hope Unk starts making music again. It'll be a good distraction for him. I think this is Pete's thing. See you, Miles. Time for some science. These wind turbines are tiny but mighty. Once deployed on high altitude currents, they are a potentially self-sustaining source of clean power. Eventually, they'll shuttle back and forth to a dock. But right now, we're looking for a way to place these for an initial test run. I think I can get these up to the right altitude with the webways. They don't call it Brooklyn Heights for nothing. Here we go! Huh. Web wings alone aren't getting me enough lift. I need a little push. The intersection of Port and Montague is super windy. I've certainly lost enough papers walking through there. Let's use that as a natural wind tunnel. Now to deploy. Fly free, little turbine. Bam! One more! There we go! Great! They're all happily launched! I'll just head back... The turbine's been compromised? What? How? Need to check on that! Gotta get up there. Talon drones attacking the turbine. We gotta stop them. You guys again? I really wish we'd stop meeting like this. They have always, and we weren't hot to. Uh, really? I'm in your way? this turbine back in place. There. All up and running. I should make sure Dr. Wynn sets up some turbine security for these. You guys need help with that? And the sandcastle competition starts? Now! And no cheating!
You just had to make it hard, huh? Crack a crystal. So I told the cops that someone's out to get us, but they don't listen to me. No one ever does. Time to take matters into my own hands. The hunters were after him. Marco put Sandman to rest years ago, and Craven woke a sleeping giant. Hey, I was just talking to my source at the raft. Marco's been belligerent and incoherent since he got there. But he said he's starting to show signs of improvement. Whatever you're doing with those crystals, keep it up. Coney Island. First off, the latest news from first responders is many injuries, but no fatalities. Small blessings. But we have got a lot of unknowns. Who perpetrated the attack? Who was the man who helped Spider-Man? I've got to be honest, folks. This is giving me not good flashbacks to the underground and rocks on brawls of last year. Here's hoping that with two Spider-Men in town, we can steer away from more citywide chaos. Anyone who tells you these things happen for a reason should be cursed with wet socks forever. Not bad. Ah, the Manhattan Bridge. Can you believe they started building it in 1901? Finished in 1909. I thought it was old when I was a kid, but now? It's just amazing the history that's in this city. See what else this thing can do. What are you doing? Science, buddy. I'm doing science. <laughs> so, Spider Man, you told MJ, but not your best friend? To protect you. I, I wanted to. Right. Yeah, I get it. And that kid you're tutoring, he's the other one? Uh, a lot happened while you were in that tank. Trust me, I know. <laughs> nice and gentle. Whoops. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna make some coffee. It looks like it's gonna be a long night.
What the hell happened here? Um, we were, we were just, um, doing some experiments. Where's Dr. Connors? Uh, maybe he took the day off? No. He doesn't take days off. I'm gonna go. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'll call you later.